Good night, you guys. Welcome back to another episode here in our Minecraft PlayStation 5 survival world. Hope you guys are all having a great day today, my friends. You already know what time it is, baby. Time for a new build. Time for a new build. Ain't that right? Nod your head if, if you know it's right. And he doesn't. He doesn't want to nod his head. He's just going to walk away from me. Okay. Perfect. Appreciate that energy. Yeah, man. I like to consider myself a festive person, to be honest. I mean... When it comes to holidays, bro, like, I'm out here building things that match that holiday, to be honest. Like, when it comes to things like Halloween, even though it's a minor holiday, there are people that don't really like to celebrate those types of events. But me, on the other hand, I built this giant pumpkin. Uh, I built a whole entire, like, snowy Christmas-themed island for Christmas, of course. And, well, today's the, uh, Easter. So, happy Easter to everyone that celebrates it. But you know what that means. I gotta build something that kind of revolves around that whole theme of easter and i have just the perfect build um i'm gonna go ahead and link this build down in the description if you want to build it for yourself it's a fast easy simple build you can go in and knock this out yourself within like i don't know 20 minutes maybe even less faster than me of course and uh i need to find a spot to build this it's not a not a big build but it is kind of like it's, it's pretty fair sized i'm not gonna lie to you uh, I'm trying to find a decent area because when I build stuff, I don't really plan out where they're going to go. I just kind of say I'm going to build this and, you know, if a, if a spot looks big enough for it, that's where I'm going to put it. So I need to just uh, find a nice place for it. So I decided that I want to put it right here, this build. I think this is a pretty fitting spot, to be honest. It's, it's going to be right here next to the pumpkin. So why not just throw it here? We got some empty land. I don't think I'm going to do anything with this area anyway. So, yeah, we can go ahead and just place it down right here. But, yeah, hopefully uh, you guys are having a good time today. You know, in Easter, celebrating the day, spending it with your with your families, your loved ones. I like Easter myself, to be honest. Even though a lot of people, like I said, don't celebrate a day like this for most people. I do tend to uh, celebrate a day like this with my family. So, hope you guys are as well. And also... I do want to mention something real quick. If this is your first time watching and you haven't yet, please do hit that subscribe button. If you like Minecraft videos and survival videos and all things Minecraft, live stream, shorts, all that good jazz, bro. Please do consider hitting that subscribe button. It does help out a lot and it does mean a lot to me. We are on the road to 10k. So if you want to help us out, you want to help us reach that goal, it would mean a lot. You don't have to, of course, but uh, if you think I'm a nice guy, I guess <laughs> I'm a nice guy, I guess. Yes, consider hitting that subscribe button. But yeah, I'm making this build literally at 1 in the morning, bro. 1.30 in the morning when I actually have to work in about four hours. Yeah, I work on Easter. That sucks. But you know what? It is what it is, man. It is what it is. You know, sacrifices got to be made, right? Got to be made. But yeah, the... The premise of this build, like, it's supposed to be a bunny coming out of, like, an Easter egg with Easter eggs on or in the basket as well. You'll see what I'm talking about when I'm finished. And, of course, if you want to go ahead and build this yourself, I will go ahead and leave a link to the build uh, in the description. Like I said, it's a small build, and you can already see. This is, like, basically the base of the build right here. You can already tell how small it is. It's not a ginormous build. I uh, just added this yellow stripe going around the egg itself. A little funky, but then again, not everything is perfect, so we can go ahead and make some exceptions. You can see the Taco Bell sign from here and the, the arcade, dude. Like, when I see that in the background, and the distance, it's kind of like making me love the progress, watching the progress of this world, you know what I mean? Like, just watching it grow and expand, like, it just puts a smile on my face. I don't know. I don't know. I just, I just like it. It makes me... Makes me happy. But yeah, let's go ahead and start uh, placing the bunny on this thing. Shout out to bunny. Just kidding. All right. No, seriously. Let's go ahead and uh, let's go ahead and get on top of here, man. I do also want to go ahead and uh, thank you guys for the support that you showed on the last episode, man. Like, that was crazy. I didn't expect a video like that to do good. Um, some of you were saying that it was it was funny, just the concept of it being like a building you know, a fast food chain being in the nether, like, that's not something you really think of, you know. Some of y'all were saying, we're like, you were comparing that place to O-Block, like, comparing the nether to O-Block, which is pretty funny. I'm not gonna lie, I laughed at a lot of your comments, so yeah. 
we want to go in and say thank you, man, for the support that you showed, man. Seriously. It means a lot, guys. It really does. You might not think it does, but to me, it means the world. But yeah, hopefully we can, uh, you know, I want to set a goal for this episode. Probably the first one I've ever done ever, like setting a goal. I've never really set a, a goal on a video before. Maybe I have, but I don't do it very often. So I want to see, like, can we hit, like, maybe, hmm, what's a pretty easy goal for us to, like, just go ahead and, and I know we can easily hit 20 likes. How about that? Yeah, 20 likes. How about we hit 20 likes on this video? I'd appreciate it, man. Come on, 20 likes. Not much. You can do it. You can do it. All right, but yeah, this building is uh, coming out nice so far, this bunny. You can see this is what it's looking like. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. It's got some big ears. I'm not going to lie. But yeah, that's kind of oh, on the water there. It's kind of like the concept of this build. It's just a bunny coming out of the the uh, Easter egg here. Yeah, I like it. It's it's pretty s simple. Uh, very fast to make, like I said. The reason I, I actually built this was because, you know, it's a pretty small build. And, well, it's late at night. This is, like, the only time I have right now to record. And I was like, oh, I got to get this video out. So, found this. And I was like, you know what? Let's do it. Let's do it. And I promise next build is going to be way bigger and better than this. So, don't don't get your hopes down. Like, don't think I'm letting you down. Because next, next build is actually going to be way better than this. This is just something quick for the uh, spirit of Easter. You know what I mean? You know what I'm wondering as I'm building this? I've always wondered, like, how come they've never added something like chocolate in the game? You know, like, why have they never added something like that? Like chocolate, you know, they have cookies in the game. You know, you can get cocoa beans, which are kind of like a form of chocolate, I guess, if you want to get all technical and you want to think about it that way. But like the actual ingredient itself, like the actual snack itself, chocolate, like why have they never added that? I don't know why it's kind of just like, like just popped up to popped up into my head out of nowhere like just the idea of chocolate or you know yeah just chocolate being in minecraft why has that never been a thing you know what i mean i don't know that's kind of strange i don't know why i just started thinking about that randomly usually around this time that's uh kind of a common thing i just started thinking about random food items random ideas i guess but um man that's another reason why i don't like to play this game late at night because uh i started getting all nostalgic bro like I don't know if this happens to anyone else or if it's just me. But like, when y'all play this game, especially like at this time, you know, late at night, do y'all ever just get nostalgic as well? Like, do y'all ever just start thinking about like, I don't know, the old Minecraft days? It's kind of how I feel whenever I play Minecraft late at night. I just start thinking about, you know, the old legacy version and like the friends I played with, Xbox 360 days. Man, I miss those days. Those were really fun, man. They really were. But yeah, I don't want to get like all like sad and, and stuff. <laughs> I don't want to uh, be a party pooper. You know, I don't want to bring you guys down. But yeah, so I added the little... These are supposed to be like eggs. Like eggs in a basket. Like when you uh, go Easter egg searching. That's like what people do, right? They, I, I hope that's just not me. You know, I hope that like people also... You know, when they celebrate Easter, they also go to like theme parks not theme park my bad like regular parks and you know they uh look for eggs there i don't know that's something i used to do as a kid i don't know if people still do that nowadays if that's still a a, a way to spend easter a good way matter of fact how do you guys spend easter i want to know how do y'all spend easter like obviously you spend it with your family right i hope but like what do you guys do on a day like this there you go man there she is the beautiful uh -huh, you can't get me, sucker. Whoa, that was weird. Freaking wandering villager. Uh -huh, you can't get me. And now bro's break dancing in the water. <laughs> okay, bro glitched out. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Buddy glitched out. All right, that's what happens, bro. He got mad that he couldn't attack me. That sucks. Uh -huh. Yeah, look at the build, man. Looks cool. I like it. Like I said, it's festive. You know what that is, obviously, when you look at it. The bunny. Easter bunny. But um, before I wrap up this episode, I actually want to go ahead and answer this really good uh, question that a viewer of mine had asked on a live stream. Let me go over here to the book and go ahead and add that because this was a really good question and I, I like this question. So this question comes from Caitlin. 
211 underscore. Thank you, Caitlin. You have made it into the book of awesome people. I have to find a good name for that, but that's what we're calling it for now of awesome people. No, but seriously, uh, congrats. You made it. But the question was, Benny, why don't you start a creative world and build really big projects? Do you just like survival better? So that is a great question, in my opinion. I do like that question a lot. Um, and I did answer this on the live stream, but I kind of want to elaborate on it a little bit more. So the reason why I actually don't really like survival that much. I mean, uh, my bad, my bad. I love survival. My bad. The reason why I don't really like to play creative that much or just like the idea of creative in general Creative is fun, you know, it, it's fun. It, it's cool, you know, it's that definitely a game mode you go to when you want to mess with your friends or you want to do some trolling or you just want to actually just get creative and build stuff. And that's kind of the problem is that when you want to build something in creative, you have everything at your disposal. You know what I mean? Like you have every item in the game, every block, just pretty much everything's at your fingertips, literally. Now, when I play survival, I obviously like to, you know, build cities. If you watch my live streams, I like to build mega towns, you know, mega cities, villages, whatever it is, man. I like to big, I like to build projects, you know. Now, I feel, I feel more rewarded, more accomplished when I do it in survival, you know. Like, I can build a world like this, even though it's not that big. I could build a world like this in creative, you know, within a week. Easily, maybe even less than a week. I could probably build all of this in a day, you know, in creative. But if I were to do something like this in survival, this whole entire town, which I have, I, I just feel more accomplished. You know what I mean? Like it feels more rewarding. Like I'm going to use another example here. I'm going to use a game that's totally like completely different to what Minecraft is. But Grand Theft Auto 5. Uh, Grand Theft Auto 5, you also have to grind in that game for something. You know, you got to grind for your money. You got to grind, you know, for your businesses. Now, you can go ahead and fast track all that by, you know, buying shark cards, spending money on the game, or, you know, that literally gets you more progress to getting something unlocked a lot quicker, you know. But for me, when I play GTA, like a game like, a game like that, I like to actually grind the game out. And, you know, when I purchase something like a vehicle... Freaking Enderman took my spruce right here, by the way. Uh, when I like when I play a game like Grand Theft Auto and I, you know, grind for money and then I buy a car that's worth like three million dollars in the game. It feels way more rewarding, you know, to to know that I grind. I, you know, I grinded for that car than if I were to purchase like a, you know, fifty dollar shark card and then just bought the car and then tuned it up right then and there. You know what I mean? Like, I don't know. You know what I mean? Like. Playing survival is just way more, it's just better, you know, it's just, I don't know. For someone that likes to just build, I feel like survival is just that option that you go to. It's kind of hard to explain. Well, not really. You, I feel like you can understand what I'm talking about, you know. It's kind of a little rant I went on, but dude, I really like that question. So, Caitlin, thank you, to, thank you, thank you so much, Caitlin, for uh, asking that in the live stream. Sorry if I went on a little rant about that. Not a rant, but like, I just kind of like to just talk about topics that are interesting. And that was very interesting in my opinion. So if you have any more good questions, anyone that's watching, feel free to ask me. And I will go on another like five minute rant answering the question. But yeah, survival for the win. It's way better. Creative? No bueno. Just kidding. Creative is cool. I like creative. I don't really play it that much, though. I do have a creative world where I like to test my builds and then bring them over into here. But that's about it. I don't uh, really like to build in uh, creative. It's a good game mode, though. But yeah, it's going to wrap it up. I'm going to wrap it up right here. Thank you guys for watching. Before I continue ranting and venting any longer, uh, thank you all for watching. If you all enjoyed this video, please make sure you drop a like. It does help out a lot. Like I said, 20 likes, bro. 20 likes, and I'll get you guys another episode on this I got another episode out for you guys ASAP. That's right, ASAP. Within a week, maybe even less than a week. Maybe within the next day. Who knows? No, I'm just kidding. But yeah, thank you all for watching. Hope you all enjoyed. Uh, if you want to build this build yourself, that uh, Easter Bunny, you can go ahead and do so. I have the link in the description to the video. But other than that, my friends, until the next one, I will see you all later. Take it easy, guys. Have a good rest of your day, man. And happy Easter.
Peace out, everyone. Goodbye.